Hey Mark, Dan here. Hey, I just learned something that pads can do that I did not think it could do. So call me stupid or what. You probably already know this, but in case you don't, here's what I just learned. That pads has the ability to to split a polygon like split mix. It has the ability to split it into two separate polygons. I did not know that. So here's a quickie demo. I've got I've got a split mix on layer two here. It's the ground plane, and um, just to look at the, the attributes of it, um, it is five mils five mils wide. It's assigned to the ground net, and when I filter for documentation and I select one of the edges, in this case the left edge. I click right and I say auto separate and what that does is it allows me to start drawing where I want these two shapes to separate so now I double click at the end and it selects the top see the the top polygon is is highlighted now and I can assign it to GND and now the bottom polygon is is selected and I can assign it power return and when I repaint the screen there you see two distinct polygons I did not know that that is crazy now I'm gonna zoom in here and I'm gonna measure the distance between these two polygons and they measure exactly 30 mils I go to my split mix uh, setup and I see that my auto separate gap is set to 30 mils and that is exactly what I have right here. Isn't that something? Okie doke. That's it. Bye.